Welcome to the channel and welcome back to another video. Now in this quick video, I wanna talk about three investments you need to make today. Now if you choose any two of these three investments and you just be as patient as possible and hold on to them for the long haul, you will have wealth. Hey, my name is Eric and I write a blog over at smartmoneybro.com. When you get a moment, take a look at our latest blog post over there on that website. Now over there, we help ordinary people just like you and I be extraordinary with our money and real estate. So I do one-on-one -on -one personal financial mentoring and coaching with folks to help them improve their situation in terms of financially. Long-term, short-term, doesn't matter. I also do free 15-minute phone conversations to look at your personal situation. If you want some help with that and you wanna give me a holler about your personal situation to get some help or some insight, please feel free to contact me. My contact information is below. So on this quick video, it's all about three investments. Now you can choose any two of these three and you're gonna be just fine in the long haul if you be patient. The very first one is index funds. Now I like index funds as opposed to mutual funds because index funds have very, very low fees. They're not managed. Mutual funds is 200 stocks that are all in a big bucket and they have a fund manager who's trying to outperform the market. Now, index funds just follow a group of funds along with the index of whatever that sector is. So index funds don't have all the management fees and costs associated with them. They have some, but they're minimal compared to mutual funds. I like total market index funds. In other words, an index fund that covers the entire stock market. The reason is this. Businesses in America are designed to increase, to get better, to increase profits, and they have incentives to increase profits. Over the course of time, 10, 15, 20 years, the stock market has a long history of going up in value because businesses increase in value. GDP increases in value. Everything increases in value. If you're covered and invested in an index fund that covers the entire market, whether it's Vanguard, Fidelity, you name it, you're gonna almost guarantee that over the course of time, you're gonna grow your money as the stock market grows, but you're also gonna pay less fees. So I'm a big fan of index funds. Hey, you gotta be in the market. You gotta be in the stock market somehow over a long course of time to help you grow your money. Number two, the second investment is real estate. You've gotta get you a piece of real estate and you gotta hold it. Whether it's commercial, residential, doesn't matter. You need a piece of income producing and equity building real estate. Real estate that not only builds in equity, but also provides you with some income along the way. You need that real estate because you want to take advantage of the fact that as cost of living goes up, inflation continues, your real estate value typically will go up. And so over the long course of time, yeah, you bought that property for $75,000 or $100,000, but in 20 years, that's gonna be $200,000 or 150 or 250 or 350. It's gonna increase over time. It's an appreciating asset. If you want wealth 20 years from now, buy real estate today. If you want some wealth 35 years from now to pass on to your grandkids, buy real estate today. I don't care if it's one property, if it's 10 properties, whatever it is, you need to be in the real estate game. Holding real estate over a long period of time will produce wealth for you down the road. The third investment is simply a business. You should be thinking about ways that you can monetize your gifts, monetize your purpose, monetize your talent, monetize what you do well. You wanna have a side business or you wanna have a full-blown business that's your primary income builder. But a business over time, growing, doesn't have to start off huge, it can start off really small and it can stay fairly small, but it will produce for you over time. If you have two of these three, in other words, if you have a business and real estate, great. If you have a business and you're invested in index funds, fantastic. If you have all three, you have some good index funds, you have good real estate, and you have a small business, fantastic. You can't lose if you invest in just two of these three. Hey, I wanted to give you this quick video to say that money is not complicated. Money is not hard to get and hard to figure out. It's simple. Two of these three investments will build your wealth over time, if you be patient. 
If you got anything out of this video at all, do me a favor, smash the like button and subscribe to the channel. Hey, the best person to take care of the old you is the young you. Do me a favor, take care of yourself and take care of other people. Until the next video, peace.